think he's a pretty good player, and um, I hate to throw this out because I don't want to start this train going, but Marshall Yonda comes to mind, and I'm not, I'm talking about Marshall Yonda in college, not, uh, if Marshall was in college what he is now, he would have been a first round draft pick, mm -hmm. uh, if everybody could go back and do it again. But I just bring, it, bring that up in that uh, whatever we asked Marshall to do when he was here, he did it pretty well. He wasn't necessarily flashy or, you know, an eye-catching guy. Um, Testing-wise, all that kind of stuff, height, weight, all those types of things. But and he just really blocked guys well. No matter where we put him, we put him at guard and tackle. And uh, you know, early in his career, I remember you know watching Baltimore and they're trying to block. Uh, they got a guy trying to block James Harrison, mm -hmm. and it's it's Marshall Yonda who was blocking him. Harrison's a darn good player. So you know, it's kind of what he was with us to put him somewhere and he'll get the job done. And uh, in that in that regard, Sean's like that. Sean just seems to wherever we move him, he seems to handle it really well. He's not 6'6 six, six and you know 330 pounds or any of that stuff, but he's just a really good football player. He's really productive on the field, and you know we, we make a living off players like that. You know, really like that that type of guy. And he's a, got an unbelievable attitude. But it's a real credit going back to last year, his perseverance, him sticking with it, and just working through uh, you know some tough situations, and uh, you know came back and just had an outstanding season. So you know, it's, uh, he can really be proud of what he's done.